I'm going to start working more on the Isuzu NPR posting videos online. I don't see any more. Um, and today we're going to be showing how to change the front brake pad, which is fairly easy. But I'll tell you what you need to do. Okay, so the tools we are going to need. We already removed the tire. The tire is for the lug nuts. 21. And then four. You have to remove the brake caliper. Um, the most important part, what you're going to do on here, well, first of all, there's two bolts on here. They're 17 millimeter. Then you'll be able to remove the brake drum off there. A lot of times what I do is just loosen one and you can pick the pad up. I mean, you can pick this up, caliber up, and slide the pin out. But you want, if the brakes are sticking for any reason, that's because of the slide pins. There's slide pins on here. I'll show you how they slide on. You want to take this grommet off, get yourself some of this brake caliper grease, and you simply slide that back on. What that's going to do is keep the dust out of here. You do not want dust, or it'll dry it out faster. So I'm trying to do this with one hand, pick up on that at the same time. If I had two hands, it would be much easier. But you want to slide that. That is going to slide into that hole with all that grease. Then you have it all connected. You're going to put your 17 millimeter bolt back in here, tighten it up, and the pads, as you can see, just slide in. I recommend replacing these right here. They come with the brake pads that I have. I'll show you the number. Replacing them. The rotors on here are good. Um, I'll do that in another video about the rotors. This is just a quick uh, brake job for the front brakes. This brakes. Let me show you the brake part number. I work on these trucks all day, every day. This is a sweeper unit. These can be all kinds. You can have anything from a refrigerator truck to a box truck, but the main engine up here, as long as it's gas, it's going to be this setup. Here's the, uh, now this is from the dealer. Brake caliper kit, that's the part number. And then you're gonna get, these are the pieces that uh, hold the brake pads in there. I would recommend placing those so that way you don't have no vibration in the new ones. But this is the pads that were on. As you can see, they're very low, worn down. If you guys wanna see any videos on anything to do with this truck, let it in the comments. Like I said, I work on these all day, every day. This is a GM 6.0 engine. Um, I take them out, the whole engine, I put the whole engine back in. I do everything to these trucks. And then if you happen to have one that has a sweeper unit on it, that's what I also work on also. So I could tell you everything you need to know in the videos um, and you know anybody else that works in these trucks share this video out because there's not many videos on Isuzu NPR trucks but I want to make a channel where it's simple everybody can understand what you're talking about and it's to the point all right thanks